Hello and welcome to the Cinema 4D Quick Tips. Since Cinema 4D released 20, we can use fields to create cool growing effects. But how can you do that? It's actually pretty easy. I already created a spherical field as the starting point, and now let's create another field that is necessary to add the grow effect. And this is the freeze field. The freeze field stores the values that it gets from the spherical field, so the start position, and it comes with the mode parameter, and this can be set to grow, which is necessary. Now you see that the parameters radius and effect strength are active, and you can adjust them. What radius does is it has a look at the surrounding points here, and once they are inside of the radius, it will grow the selection. So if I press play now, nothing happens, because nothing is inside of the 10 cm radius. But if I bring it up to, let's say, 20, you see that the whole thing grows. Now let's fine tune this by varying the radius, and this is possible by going to the radius tab here. And now you see there is another field list. So here let's create a random field. Let's set it to noise. Perlin is OK. And let's bring up the scale to 400%. And let's hit play again. OK, you see that it started, but at some point it stops. And this is because the radius is too low. So let's go back to the layer tab and let's increase the radius to be maybe 30, because this is the maximum radius and this will be masked using the noise that we created. Maybe 30 is a bit too high. Let's bring it down to 25. And this looks quite good. So in order to fine tune it a little bit more, we can also create another layer, which is the delay. And this is set to smooth by default. This is actually the same as the delay effector. We can set it to spring. And then you see that it wobbles a bit here. And this makes the effect a bit more interesting. Thanks for watching. For more information on Cinema 4D or other Maxon products, please visit cineversity.com or maxon.net.